their brothers and sisters in Christ in today's gospel reading from Matthew chapter 16 verses 13 to 20 we encounter a significant moment in the life of Jesus and his disciples this passage presents a powerful lesson about faith identity and the foundation upon which the church is built the scene takes place in Caesarea Philippi where Jesus asked his disciples a crucial question who do people say the the Son of Man is this question is not only about public opinion but also about personal understanding the disciples respond with various answers reflecting the diverse perspective people have about Jesus even today then Jesus directs the question to his disciples directly but what about you who do you say I am Simon Peter boldly steps forward and declares you are the Christ the son of the living God this con confession of faith is a pivotal moment as Peter recognizes Jesus as the promised Messiah and the divine son of God Jesus responds to Peter's confession with a profound promise blessed are you Simon son of Jonah for this was not revealed to you by flesh and blood but my father in heaven Jesus emphasizes that Peter's understanding is a result of divine revelation a gift from God this reminds us that true faith is not merely a product of human intellect but a gift of grace that we receive when we open our hearts to God's truth Jesus goes on to give Peter a new name Peter which means rock he then declares on this rock I will build my church and the gates of Hades will not overcome it here Jesus establishes Peter as the foundation of the church symbolizing the steadfast faith upon which the community of believers would be built this image of a rock signifies the stability strength and unwavering faith that should characterize our relationship with God as we reflect on this passage we are called to examine our own faith journey are we like Peter boldly confessing Jesus as the Son of God and the foundation of our lives are we open to receiving divine revelations that deepen our understanding of Christ's rule in our lives are we building our lives on the, the rock of faith ensuring that the storms of doubt and challenges will not shake us just as Jesus promised to build his church on the rock of Peter's confession he continues to build his church on the collective faith of a believers our faith when rooted in Christ becomes a source of strength guidance and hope it empowers us to overcome the trials we face and to bring light to the world to a world in need of God's love let us pray for the grace to have a firm and unwavering faith like Peter's that can withstand the test of time and circumstance may we be open to God's revelations and constantly seek a deeper understanding of Jesus as the foundation of our lives and may our lives shine 
as a testament to the transformative power of faith in Christ, so that others may be drawn to the unshakable hope that only He can provide. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.